25 years later, Carrie Strug relives iconic moment from 1996 Olympic Games skateboarding medalists on what they'll do next time they are stopped by cops for skating US Olympians take us inside the Tokyo Athlete Village to show us what life is like rowing. The women's coxless four makes a return at the Tokyo Olympic Games Olympics open with a thud for Team USA. Bright spots ahead with skateboarding and surfing what music do Olympians hype up to ahead of competition? We ask what's on their playlist. The Cleveland Guardians have arrived NFL to punish teams whose unvaccinated players cause outbreaks how wrestling feels like art to Olympian Helen Marulis rapid fire with TJ Watt and Randy Buffington what you missed from the Olympics opening ceremony and what you need to watch on Saturday the one-year delay of the Tokyo Games brought a renewed love of surfing to Carissa Moore Olympic gymnast Simone Biles adoption shows the strength of family team USA fencer Curtis McDowell dedicates Olympic journey to his two moms as Tom Brady finally being himself? And he is funny. Tampa, Florida. Rob Gronkowski surely is an expert when it comes to Super Bowl championship rings. Just catch his vibe about the latest hardware. The magnificent rings the Tampa Bay Buccaneers received last week. It's a nice switch up to my collection, adding gold to it, which is really neat, Gronkowski told USA Today Sports after Wednesday's practice. The tight end won three Super Bowl rings with the Patriots, all of which he also happened to bring to the Bucks ring ceremony last week. The ring's fabulous, Gronkowski said. Spectacular. The way you pop up the ring and then you can see the stadium up over the top of it inside is very special. It feels good to have everyone back, he said, alluding to Tampa returning all 22 starters on offense and defense. We've just got to keep working hard. We've got a target on our back now. Everybody's going to be coming for us. But we still need to improve and get better. Gronkowski, 32, looked extremely fluid in drills this week. Sure, it's early yet it is significant enough when considering the assortment of injuries he has battled throughout his career and his rugged style. I'm feeling pretty good, he said. I want to be playing fast, playing quick, every time I hit the field. So, you've got to be taking care of yourself, Arians knows. The Bucks coach held Gronkowski and several other veterans, including Tom Brady, linebacker Jason Pierre-Paul and center Ryan Jensen, out of drills on Wednesday as a maintenance day. The players attended the practice but were limited to mental reps. The first sessions in full pads are slated for this weekend. You stack this with an off day, Thursday, so it's back-to-back -back down days on the body, Gronkowski said. I love having a little rest and recovery day as a veteran going into my 11th year. Arians. The NBA coined the term, load management. I just always said, off day. The coach figures Gronkowski has earned a bit of a break with his fast start to camp. Arians praised Gronkowski's work ethic which he maintains can easily get overshadowed by his Gronk persona. He's a lot of fun, Arians said. I love just chewing his ass out, so, he'll say. Yeah, right dude, quote. 